Hello and welcome to careerrai.com. Myself Nishant and in this section I am going to cover some ASP.NET interview questions and answers. First question: What is fragment caching in ASP.NET? Fragment caching allows to cache a specific portion of the page rather than the whole page. It is done by implementing the page in different paths by creating everything in the form of user controls and caching each user control individually. Fragment caching is useful when you need to cache only a subset of a page. Navigation bars, headers and footers are the good candidates for fragment caching. Next question: What is partial class in .NET? When there is a class which is big enough to have multiple number of developers implementing the methods in it, the class can be separated and written in different files as partial class. Partial classes allow us to divide the class definition into multiple files. Logically all the partial classes are treated as a single file by the compiler. Next question. What are assemblies? An assembly is a single entity that can be deployed. It contains all the detail about the implementation of the classes, structures and interfaces. It is similar to DLL files. Assemblies have the classes and functions that can be reused. The detail of assembly are saved in its metadata which contains the name version number security details dependencies details and list of files by which the assembly is constituted name spaces are also saved in the assemblies asp.net applications are deployed in the form of assemblies next question what is the difference between trace and debug in asp.net the system diagnostic name space contains the debug and trace classes for tracing Tracing is the process of gathering information related to the program's execution whereas debugging is the process of searching and solving errors in the program. Next question. What is view state? Explain its benefits and limitations. View state is used to retain values on postback. It helps in preserving a page. View state is internally maintained as a hidden field in encrypted form along with a key. Advantages. View state hardly consumes server resources. View state ensures security because it stores the data in encrypted format. View states are simple to use. They are used by just enabling or disabling the view state properties. View state can be implemented both at the page level and at control level. Disadvantages: While using view state, if large amount of data is stored on the page, then page load might cause a problem. View state cannot be tracked across pages. View state information does not automatically transfer from page to page 